Hey, what up, dudes and dudes? I'm Chris from Biosaurus, and today I'm gonna bring you a review from a Transformer from the series Reveal the Shield. And it's pretty cool. The name of this guy is Turbo Tracks. I really don't remember it from back in the day, but it's a great transformer. I'm really happy that I found this guy. I found it on Ross store for about seven bucks here, right across San Isidro. So it's pretty cool. A pretty cool uh, alt mode that rolls out pretty nice, and it has nice uh, paint there. Kind of cool, right? I think they sell some kind of sticker so it looks better. The rims on this car are pretty cool. Now on the bottom you can see some parts of uh, roll parts but uh, you don't make that out so it looks pretty nice still. So yeah translucent uh, windows here pretty cool looks like panels and something like that are going on there so it's cool here on the back this is paint black on the front it has uh, paint here on the front lights pretty cool paint here on the drill pretty nice spoilers are not painted but still looks great here on the back the tail lights pretty nice exhaustion pretty cool didn't put lights here on the on the bottom light so sorry paint but it still looks pretty nice now this guy has an alt mode well um, two modes or three modes if you want to call it okay so here we have the flight mode right <sighs> So it looks pretty cool. The little wings are nice, nice detail. Well, this is the little wings. So as you can see, how the detail, little red stripe there. They're cool. So yeah, this is like all the guys put this guy to flight mode. So just pull out this, and that's it. Also, you can pull out this uh, the wheels here. You can pull it down, and it's kind of look more futuristic, right? Just like uh, Back to the Future. <laughs> Or some figures from, uh, well, well, mask. I think. The rims are pretty nice. Why does it focus on the rims and on the freaking wing it doesn't focus? <laughs> well, thing is that it looks cool like that. Check it out. So it's like, like hovering or something like that. But you put it like this, and it's uh, in an angle that's going down, right? So it's, it doesn't look cool. So I found a way that you can even make it look more futuristic flying car so just uh, pull out this part here from the front pull out these things here you unpack this bend it like this to the front and now ladies and gentlemen we have a flying car mode and it looks more badass like this right you can even turn this part here if you like if you want to have more more details to the front right this is my flight mode of uh, turbo tracks it looks pretty nice reminds me of the cars from uh, the figures uh, mask the ma mask well, or something like that I, rem I don't remember and also from uh, the back to the future car kinda so it's pretty nice pretty nice uh, other mode that you can display it with but uh, I rather display it in robo mode it looks pretty badass in robo mode as well or car mode it's also come with these little weapons. It has two of them. It has like where to grab it here and another pick hole here. You can just turn it here or bend it here. So what you can do is that you can put it here. I also I'm gonna show you how it's gonna look on car mode. So you can clip it here so it looks more badass er <laughs> missiles on the side and stuff. So yeah there we go. Pretty cool. Pretty cool figure. And also, also, if you open this part here, as you can see here is like a little cut. Well, you have to open it like that. The pegs here, you just press it. And the panel is going to turn. Just turn it, it's going to have two pegs here. And now the car has two pegs here, right? It was cool if uh, the, it had embedded something that you can put it in. It's going to look like a flying thingy on the back, but like some sport cars have. Spoiler on the back, or I don't know what the hell you want to call you can pack this uh, missiles here on the back and it looks cool right like missile like he's, he's kind of flight mode so I think in flight mode this uh, looks better 
I think so. <laughs> the complete flight mode and looks awesome. <laughs> so there we go, Turbo Tracks and flight mode. Pretty cool, huh? All right, so now we have Turbo Tracks alone without the missiles. Like this, oh, and I leave the pick hole so you can check how it looks without the flight mode. So yeah, you can put it even on car mode like that and it kind of looks cool, right? It doesn't look too bad. Check it out. You can roll it pretty cool or you can put it on the side it has a little clip here and here on the bottom has a little where to click it so you just click it in there then now he has missiles on the bottom of the car I don't know what was the idea of this purpose right but uh, there you go it has another where to put those thingies so I just leave them there because I don't want to lose them so I don't like to display them with these things here if it's in car mode just better off without this and it looks pretty cool pretty nice card mode transformer okay so now for the good part we're gonna transform this guy all right it's kind of cool transformation I really like it I'm gonna show you because it's really cool so first you're gonna open this part here then you're gonna pull this part here on the, from the back just pull it up like this and you're gonna move the arms like this so you can pull out the the wheel up to this part so it's gonna be out of the way right now you can unpick uh, well just pull down a little bit like this just open this part here so you can move this side and the other one it's still gonna be his uh, wing thingies on the right so you can pull it sideways like this as you can see I'm sorry I forgot to pull out the gun you can take it off from the back here and then you also transform it so it's pretty cool pretty cool gun really like the gun pretty nice now you just pull out this uh, the arms like this to the side this one as well to the side this piece here you just pull it up and his head's gonna pop out and this things on the side just pull it out like this and now we have almost transformed you um, unpack this part here I recommend to grab it like this because it's a little tight so you can pull it down you turn this part here then you just unbend this and pull it out let me show you from the outside just pull it down and then to the back so that's gonna be his heels so just pull down the feet and they're really loose, I mean, they were loose from the beginning, so I'm gonna need to use something in there, so there are more. This was my first problem, I didn't know what to do here, I was thinking I'm gonna break it if I move it up, right? But you're not gonna break it, just move it up, and that's it. And just pull out the backpack, and it snaps there, on the back, so it's pretty cool. And this part, you just bend it like this, and then snap it into those pegs here. So there we have Turbo Tracks, almost transformed. Has little wings here you can pull it up as well you can play with these wings and however you want to put them turbo tracks pretty nice transformer man really like this guy the head sculpt is nice really cool white and red <laughs> thing is that too white does not help me out right now <laughs> so there we have I had to take out the lights sorry guys because this guy is too white has nice articulation as well doesn't have that gray the crappy gray color glad of that even on this part they didn't use the gray I'm sorry the gray crappy color in there so it looks pretty awesome but also you can put this uh, missiles on the back snap it in there you can play also with this uh, guns however you want to use it all the way back, pointing to the pointing up. So it uh, depends on you, right? Pretty cool figure. Really like it. All right, and he's gone. Well, you just you also can can peg it back there, or you can just put it in his hand. It fits kind of nice, but sometimes it just don't hold it too cool because this thing here is not too long. So, can have some kind of problem, but yeah, you can. He can hold it, as you can see. So, so yeah, pretty cool figure, man. Really like the details on this guy. 
pretty nice the legs are pretty cool looking only this part here that I said is too loose here's how he looks from the back pretty cool the wings standing out there pretty nice so yeah let's go for the articulation on this guy the articulation you can rotate the head 360 degrees all right pretty cool moves up and down a little bit uh, sideways a little bit the arm you can rotate it 360 degrees also he has bicep articulation pretty badass man he has double jointed elbow that is freaking cool as well and even he has rotation on the wrist so that's just awesome to be a transformer that's just amazing articulation on this guy man pretty cool you can do a lot of crazy poses with him here on the chest uh well on the waist he can rotate 360 degrees no ab crunch but come on that's just too much man <laughs> he has a move on the legs he can move it out front the back he can move it sideways and he can do the bandam shiera Put it back again rotation on the knee pretty cool and this is the only sad part of this guy that the knee is hindered by the motion on this thing here so you cannot bend it too much down and uh, it goes only to here man so that's kind of sucks really sucks on that and also it's kind of loose as well so yeah but also you can pose it on any other position that you want so you can be creative with this guy and uh, he's gonna look nice guys this is a uh, turbo tracks pretty cool transformer if you get to see him and you like transformers this guy is just one mass half just awesome so we have bumblebee next to him bumblebee is a little bit smaller as you can see so yeah turbo tracks hope one day you can find it dudes if you like transformers it's a great figure to have sorry for the lights i don't know what's going on with the camera today it didn't pick up details in anything so kind of sucks so later on dudes uh, hope you have a great day beers or us out baby laters